So for task number three, we need to modify a few GitHub settings. So we'll go to, in our organization here, we'll go to settings and actions in general. So the first one, the policies needs to allow all actions and reusable workflows. Uh, that one is probably default. Um, we're not going to allow workflows to run from fork pull requests that would allow people to actually submit code and run it on our runners before we approve it. Um, workflow permissions down here, read write or read repository contents is doesn't matter because the the GitHub token um, or the workflows in the ALGO does contain the, the required permissions. So so this one doesn't matter. But this one Allow GitHub Actions to create and approve pull requests is important because our update AL system files workflow will actually uh, require that. So we'll click that and save. And beside that, um, we'll go to, let me see out here, the org people and invite uh, Freddy DK in order for me to be able to assist troubleshooting any issues you might have. That's it. And just a member can see all of our members. Granted, da, 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 da. they can create new teams and repositories. Send an invitation. And on my personal account here, I'll go to organizations where I now have a new invite from uh, Front DK Org, and I'll join that organization. Going back to uh, Fred's test organization here, I'll see that now there are no pending invites, so uh, instead I have two members here. That's it.